We're good on the field. Drivers behind the line. In three, two, one, go. Welcome to qualification match number 17 here at the Canadian Pacific Regional. Five of six robots, four of six, sorry, showing signs of life early. Rare exhibition there with a piece of algae making its way up onto the net. Here in the autonomous period, worth four points towards that Blue Alliance score. It's still, though, not enough to give them the lead coming out of auto. They trail by two to the Red Alliance. Both alliances now quickly making their way back to the coral walls. Blue Alliance mostly scattering it all across the seabed. Red Alliance keeping it a little bit more orderly here as the coral stays within the machines of the Hawaiian kids and Peninsula. Palo Alto's team currently ranked number one, average rank point five so far this morning for that 60-36 team. Doing quite well, they'll bounce some of the algae out of their way, make room for more coral in that robot and drive straight over to the reef. Looking to scoop up probably another level three indeed. That's where it falls. Blue Alliance side of the field looks a little bit more chaotic though. Four robots over here, three of them blue, one red, and then just a litany of coral scattered all across the floor. Some of that's getting picked up now by the Crusaders as they find their rhythm. There goes a level three. It's gonna get followed up by a level four coming at you from the Funky Monkeys at 846 machine right here in the back of the field. And that one's good. They've nearly filled up the entire level four of this reef, reaching for the sky. That's the Blue Alliance machine of Raid Zero. Bottom of the screen there. Back to the Coral Station they go. Very few level four spots left. Raid Zero reaches up for five points on the line if they can connect, but it falls back to the trow and then back to the sea floor with 45 seconds left to play. Red Alliance currently trailing by about 20 points. Hawaiian kids starting to eat away at some of that, dialing in the Coral Cycles. Back to the wall they go, lining up. Now starting to take some of the lower levels of the reef, picking up a three-pointer on level two just now. It's followed up very quickly by Peninsula Robotics level three for four points, and back and forth they go. They're working on while the Blue Alliance works on bringing it downwards towards the trow. 15 seconds left, and now we'll hurry, scurry our way towards the barge zones in the middle of the field. Currently sitting at Four points to either side in endgame score, but up goes the Blue Alliance Crusaders machine on that deep cage. Potentially worth 12 as long as they can stay airborne, and it looks like that's going to be good for them. Mirror image from the star final. That one's going to be a tie. 142 points apiece. So now we see what happens when you put two defending regional champions up against each other. Indecisive. One ranking point for each of those alliances.